Hey guys, in this video, I want to explain $4,000 USDB tax credit. What are the requirements? What kind of cars qualify for it? How to claim it and everything about it. Let's get started. First of all, since January 1st, 2024, they changed a few things about getting a rebate tax credit, uh, which made it everything a lot more easier. Before these changes, it was uh, a little bit more difficult. You purchase a vehicle, for example, in the beginning of the year, and then in order to get a tax credit, you had to file your taxes uh, in the end of the year or next year, and only then you could get your tax credit. But starting January 1st of 2024, that rebate of $4,000 for UZV tax credit could be deducted at the sign up. If you want to purchase a vehicle right now, let's say a Tesla that qualifies for UZV tax credit, it costs, let's say, $20,000. Uh, you went to buy it from a dealership, right? And that $4,000 EV tax credit could be applied right there. So basically, you'll pay $16,000. Uh, for the price of the car and the dealership will get four thousand dollars from the irs and the only thing that you will need to do is get that form that the dealership will give you and when you are doing your taxes next year you just show it you basically you file it you don't have to sit and wait for that four thousand dollars because the dealership will get that four thousand dollars from the irs during 15 days after the sale was done to learn more about this tax ev credit uh, you can go to fueleconomy.gov. This is government website, and uh, for used EV for used EVs, there are four thousand dollars tax credit, and there are a few requirements. You must be an individual who bought the vehicle for use and not for resale, not to be the original owner, not be able to be claimed as dependent on another person's tax uh, tax returns, not have claimed another used EV uh, vehicle credit in three years before the purchase date. In addition, your modified adjusted gross income may not exceed $150,000 for married, filing jointly, or a surviving spouse, $112,500 for heads of the house, $75,000 for all other filers. Basically, if you are uh, single, the gross income should not exceed $75,000. And qualifying vehicles are it, it must be made by qualified manufacturers. So basically all the um, big brands uh, qualify for it. It must have a sales price of $25,000 or less. If the car is $25,000 and more, does not qualify for it. It must have a model year at least two years earlier than the calendar year when you buy. So basically right now it's 2024, uh, the, the car model should be 2022 and preferably 2021 and older. It must not have already been transferred after August 16, 2022. Basically, let's say the car uh, is 2018, right? And it has one owner. It means it qualifies. But let's theoretically say that that car has two owners and the second owner purchased that vehicle in September of 2023. Then it means it does not qualify. Even if he purchased that vehicle on September of 2022, it still does not qualify. The car, the last time it was purchased, it should be August 16, 2022 or earlier. It must be for use primarily in the US because it's US tax credit. It must have a gross vehicle weight of 14,000 pounds. Basically, almost all the cars qualify for it. And for, now, or for right now, uh, the sale qualifies only if you buy a vehicle from a dealer. As a dealer myself, what the dealers uh, should do is go to IRS uh, website to sign up for it. It will take like from uh, 15 days to well, up to two months to get registered there and get approved. And there will be a special account where they will file all your information to the IRS. And then after a sale, up to 15 days, they will receive $4,000. Uh, UZV tax credit and at, at the time of filing they will get the special form that they have to share it with the buyer and that buyer will show it when they are filing their taxes and there's a hack for private sell sellers as well if uh, you are not a dealer or if you are not buying from dealer there's a small hack that you could still get your uh, UZV tax credit and I'll show you in a minute 
Right now, let's check out what kind of vehicles qualify for it. And the easiest way to check it out, let's say I could put 2015 and uh, I'll choose Tesla. And more or less, it's the production model of uh, Model S started in 2012. That's why you have all these years. There's one 2015 Model S P85D that we have. It has four owners, but the good thing is that the last owner that owned that vehicle was in 2020. And that means that uh, used EV tax credit was not transferred, was not used, was not used. And that car qualifies for $4,000 used EV tax credit. And to check out Model uh, 3, let's get to 2017. And there are Model 3 from 2017 up to 2022 that qualify. Model X 2016 to 2021 qualify and not only Tesla's we can go to let's say Kia and there's a Kia EV that qualifies for it we can go to BMW see BMW i3 also qualifies for it then Hyundai Ionic Hyundai Ionic of course qualifies for that credit and we can try Ford. There's Ford Focus Electric that qualifies for it. Basically, you can come here and uh, check out everything, or you can just clear all of this and go step by step here and find out if your vehicle qualifies for it or not. And here you can double check that the sales price of the vehicle should not be more than $25,000. It should be $25,000 and less. And for private sellers, there is a website called Key Savvy. Never used it. I heard it a few times, those people who contacted me about buying a vehicle. What they do is they use their dealer license to enable, in, enable private party sales to qualify for used EV tax credit. From my understanding how it works, the seller will sell his car to Key Savvy. Then Key Savvy as a dealership will sell it to the buyer. This way, the car qualifies for your $4,000 USDV credit. Everyone is happy. I don't know what is their percentages, how they make their money, how much they take from it. But there is a chance if you want to go deep into, the, into this or find out more about this, I will leave the link in the description so you can check it out. If you guys have any questions, leave in the comments below and I hope that this video was valuable. If it was, give it a thumbs up. Also, you can check out the hybrid auto deals to see what kind of cars I'm selling and there might be your next car in there. And of course, we'll make a great deal. Right, guys, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.